Kurdish and Swiss youth to protest against the detention of activists. This afternoon, Kurdish and Swiss youth groups will organize a demonstration in Basel to demand the immediate release of those jailed in the Netherlands by the Dutch authorities. Youth from the Kurdish community in Europe demonstrated against the OPCW in The Hague, Netherlands, on December 3, 2021. The Dutch police assaulted the young activists, arresting 55 of them and injured 10 others. During this event, which received worldwide media attention, claimed the statement and proceeded as follows. An independent probe has been urged by Kurdish groups, but the Organization for the Prohibition of Chemical Weapons, OPCW, seems to have ignored their calls. They couldn't pretend that nothing had occurred when children were killed by chemical weapons. Of course, the police brutally attacked the teenage activists who staged the most high-profile protest in recent memory and gained entry to and control of the OPCW headquarters. All the comrades who took part in this action were applauded, and the OPCW building was assaulted with the chant, BG Sorok Arpo. In recognition of their tenacity and resolve, Thet gave them a pat on the back. It's now illegal in the Netherlands to detain more than 50 members of our own party. We are all aware that an organized army cannot be attacked. People throughout Europe, especially patriotic young people, should march to the streets to support their children, denounce the silence of these institutions, and react to the police violence. It's becoming more difficult to defend ourselves from those who would harm us. In the past, they fought back, and now it's our time. Freedom-loving individuals can't be stopped by any means.